Hey, Helgrim here. Welcome to episode 4 of Let's Play Free Space 1. This is going to be mission 3 and I can see they're still fixing up the side pod that I bashed up last time. So yeah, let's see what the next mission is going to be. Ah. Welcome to advanced training. In today's course, you will <laughs> learn the basics of messaging, countermeasures, and the support ship. Alright, this is going to be another training for my second wings. So, it's going to be two missions, I think. So, this episode will have two. There we go. Alright, Alpha One. Now you're going to learn about messaging and countermeasures. Alright, sir. Here comes your first target. Go ahead and target Praetor 01. Good. Now call in some reinforcements. Press the communications key to bring up the messaging window. From there, press the 4 key followed by the 1 key and your reinforcements will arrive. Good job. Hey guys. First, make sure you still have Praetor 01 targeted. Yes it is. Now I'm going to show you how to disarm your target using your wingman. Press the communications key to bring up your messaging box again. Okay. Now select 2 to send your orders to a wing rather than just a ship, then the 1 key to choose Epsilon Wing. By choosing Epsilon Wing, you are sending your orders to that wing only. Finally, press the 3 key to sir, disarm disarming target. Your target. This means they'll destroy all the weapons. Observe that your wingmen Obviously. have made every effort not to destroy your target. They will only attempt to disarm, thus making sure your target will no longer be able to attack you with any of its weapons. Alright. The next step will be to disable your target. By giving this order to your wingmen, they will take out the engines of your target, thus disabling it from moving. Alright. So disarm, disable, destroy. Triple D. You will once again bring up the messaging window by pressing the communications key. Roger. Next disable select your two target. for wing and one for epsilon. Finally, press the two key to disable your target. So they fly around neatly and target the engines. Let's see. As you can see, your wingmen are now huh. taking out the engines of there Raider Zero One. It won't take them long to knock out the engines of this freighter, but keep in mind that other targets can require many more hits to disable it than this freighter Three does. Three engines, please. Come on, man. Just one more engine. Disable Roger. it. Roger, disabling your target. Sometimes they need some extra attention. Thank you. Now it's time to put that freighter out of its misery. Order your wingmen to destroy the freighter. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. I was gonna press the communications button to bring up the messaging window, Just followed by the two key to select a wing, then the one key to select the one wing. Finally, press the one key to have them destroy your target. Well done, pilot. Thank you. Well, how does it feel to have ordered your first kill? I did that Hope last mission. I enjoyed it because I want you to do it again. Another freighter. I want you to order Epsilon Wing to destroy Freighter 02. Have you remembered your previous Breaking instructions? To attack. If you need to, you can look on your directives for previous instructions of the same goal. Come on, guys. That one at the bottom, he's just slacking off. He's like, nope, nope, I don't care. Oh. Congratulations, you've got the last shot. Nicely done, Alpha One. I think you've got this down. Alright, that one was the, definitely the loot ninja. He's probably gonna need okay, all the loot. Okay, pilot. Now that you've had your fun, I want you to order Epsilon Wing to depart. Kill steal, loot ninja. To do this, press the communications yes, key to bring up the messaging window. Select two for Wing and one for Epsilon. 
Finally, press Z. Good job. Bye, guys. A piece of debris that's coming. All right, pilot. Closer. Now it's time to learn about countermeasures. Oh, great. The countermeasure presents a new target for the pursuing missile to go oh, after, I hate thus this. causing the missile to avoid your ship. As you will soon see, this does not always work. For this lesson, we are bringing in one of our Leviathan-class cruisers. Their gunner will be getting practice hitting a moving target. You. <laughs> Don't worry, Great. these are just dummy missiles designed to give you a feel for live fire. Oh, it's a Leviathan, it's not a Fenris. The off was a fungus. This one's blue. In a few seconds, the Neptune will begin to launch missiles at you. Once the missiles are incoming, you will press the countermeasures key to release your countermeasures. Whee! You should also immediately increase your forward velocity to maximum and fly away from the pursuing missile. In fact, you should be using your afterburners a great deal of the time. You will use your afterburners to help maintain a high speed. Additionally, you should try to keep the missile pointer at a 3 or 9 o'clock position. Ah, there we go. Then, when the missile is nearly upon you, launch the countermeasure. Listen to the beeping sound of the missile lock to gauge the distance of the missile. The quicker the beeps, the closer the missile. Try turning your ship about in sharp movements. This will further help you to avoid being hit by the missile. When you have successfully evaded a missile, an indicator will come up in the upper portion of your targeting reticle. This will alert you to the fact that you indeed evaded the missile. you to reload your countermeasures. To do this, you will need to call in Phew. a support ship. That was fun. <clears throat> support ship being deployed. You will do this by pressing the communications key to bring up your messaging window, followed by the 5 key for rearm. In order for the support ship to dock, you must bring your ship to a complete stop. The support ship will then automatically dock with you. Check your indicator in the lower portion of the HUD, which shows the ETA for the support ship. It's probably the first and last time you'll see this in-game from me. The ship docking. The support ship's primary purpose is twofold. First, it will reload your ship with any secondary weapons complete, and countermeasures. Keep in mind, a support ship can only load as many weapons as it has on board. It may not be enough to fully reload you. Finally, the support ship is capable of making minor repairs to your ship. It can fully repair any damaged or destroyed subsystem on your ship. However, the support ship is not capable of repairing your main hull. Alright pilot, now for a little more practice with countermeasures. The Neptune is going to fire at you again. Take evasive actions. Come on. Well, at least I'm giving it a fighting chance. I 
pilot, I believe that will be enough for today. Chief. The Neptune needs to continue Thank. its training elsewhere, and you've had enough for one day. Thank you. You've done a good job considering you're just a rookie. Return what? to base. Of course, I'm still a rookie. Well, that was kill commands, disable commands, and countermeasures. Well done, pilot. You have completed phase one of advanced training. Thank you. Terran intelligence has detected oh. unusual activity in the Vasudan cargo depot at Antares. You are to destroy all hostiles in the area. When the area is clear, our salvage crews will pick up the cargo for analysis. Do not destroy any cargo. Okay. So we go from phase one to training to a brand new mission, small deadly space. Well, let's see what this brings. The contents of the cargo containers is unknown. Due to the unusual activity, GTA intelligence suspects they have military value. You will be flying this mission with Epsilon Wing from the third squadron. Delta Wing will be available for reinforcements if necessary. If you get in trouble, don't hesitate to call them in. Reconnaissance missions have determined that there are typically two wings of the Sudan fighters guarding the depot. The fighters are your primary concern. Recon has also determined that this depot is heavily used. Taking control of it will seriously impede any Vasudan attacks from this system in the future. It is likely that there will be freighters in the area transporting cargo. All Vasudan vessels must be destroyed. None must escape as they will surely bring reinforcements. Great. I don't like this mission. Once you have secured the area, the GTC Orf will arrive and maintain watch over the outpost. Red. Good luck, pilot. GTA command out. Sir, yes, sir. Okay, so we still can't pick any. These, uh. These might be good for the transports. They don't go very fast and they do more damage than this one. Okay. We'll go with this. Reading five enemy fighters. I'm on it. Cargo depot sighted, sir. Moving in to attack. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. Whoa! Check your six, pilot. There we go. Ow. Check your six, pilot. Aw, oh, that... No bandits in the area! This is off to a rough start. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. Alright, here we go. Oh, crap. I hit the wrong keys. Time to rearm. Look at that hull integrity. Whoops. Uh, where the hell's Transport Omega? There you are. Oh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. Looks like weapon prototypes ah. are here after all. Good job, Alpha One. Rearming complete, sir. That was bad. 
bad flying helium. That was really bad, I'm sorry guys. This is not really a good representation of how to play this game. Oof. Oh, we already got that one. Yeah, okay. New bandits in the area! Oh gosh, you gotta be kidding. Steer clear from Thanks those. for your help, Alpha One. We'll take over now, Alpha One. Thanks for your no. assistance. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. One percent. Oh. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. There we are. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. Well, we first go on cleanup duty. There we go. One percent. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Bye, guys. I'm out of here. Phew! This mission has never been this intense. <laughs> the destruction of the Basudan fighters was very important. Not only have we gained control of that depot, but we've shown the Basudans in this sector we are not to be trifled with. Elimination of the Basudan freighters will hinder the transport of necessary supplies to their forces in that sector. All Basudan cargo was captured and brought to our base. Intelligence will analyze it. It appears that among the cargo were some stolen weapons prototypes. We had feared that the Vasudans had already found and moved them from the area. Recapturing the weapons would have been a great victory. Unfortunately, the contents of this cargo were stolen by a trader flying the Omega Transport. <sighs> These prototypes will need to be recovered. <sighs> Whew, that was a whole lot more intense than I anticipated. Well, I hope you enjoyed me almost dying, and I'll see you again next time. Bye!